Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Marisa. How is everyone doing today? And if you are new here, thank you so much for watching today and welcome. So today I have another pretty huge craft haul. I am obsessed and I blame all you crafters out there. No, I'm just kidding. But I, it started with the papers. I mean, it all started from Gina from, um, Gina loves to craft. Um, oh my goodness. But, uh, no, I, I appreciate her deeply. I am in love with doing this and I just went full throttle into the crafting world and I'm learning a little something new every day. I am actually going to try and make my first rosette. But anyway, so I got quite a few things from a few different places. Uh, this is a Hobby Lobby Dollar Tree Michaels and also I had uh, supported two different YouTube channels that have their own shop. Okay, so I'm actually going to start with them. So this channel, well, her name was uh, Evelyn Creativa, but this is the name of her shop, Beadcraft Chic. Look how cute that is. And she even gave me a little gift. This is so adorable. Thank you so much, Evelyn. And so I got my first Maggie Holmes um, papers, and I believe this is Maggie Holmes as well. Yeah, so this is Evelyn's information here. And yeah, so this is some papers. I already started using it. This is the Flourish um, collection. Look how beautiful that is. I'll do a quick flip through, but these are beautiful. And then this is the bigger one here just gorgeous I mean just look at that Let's see how you've been using them um, just beautiful papers so that is from um, her shop then there was another youtuber and I forgot the name of her channel maybe it's the same name but it's uh, KG crafts Again, very cute card. And so I got some little tickets here. Really pretty. Um, I got some ephemera um, and many more. So that I am stocked up on birthdays. So I thought that was adorable. Um, I got some. This is by Carpe Diem, Rosies. I got some beautiful flowers here very beautiful and then also from Rosie's this beautiful mini die this dream catcher die that was gorgeous and then I got some sprinklets because I got some shaker dies I want to use them and then I got some sparklets look how beautiful those are beautiful and then I can use these like on the cards just as embellishments and so these are embellishments, but you know, maybe I could use them in the shakers. So that is from their two little shops. Okay. And then here is the Michael section. I just got this one today. I got this last week. This is Secret Gardenia. What is this? Recollections. So pretty. I love the gold um, like trims and stuff. That is that. Oh, look how beautiful this is. These are the papers that I just love the most. And then this is a fairy tale. Look how pretty that is. And little fairies in there. Yeah, this is a really nice one. It has a lot of cut aparts in here too. If I could find them, but this is beautiful. Look how pretty that, there they are. Because some of these smaller pads sometimes don't have those like little cutouts. But yeah, so that's beautiful. A little fairy in there. And then these were a great sale. Now my 
um, like die cut uh, embossing machine is very small. I have the Sissix um, Sidekick, but what I do have is this like stylus. It's the, an embossing stylus. I bought this maybe last month, um, so I could do hand um, embossing as well. Okay, so these are on sale. This is buy one, get one 50% off. And uh, embossing folders, recollections, six pieces. And um, I could do some hand embossing. I think these will fit in the sidekick, but I'm not sure, but that's okay. And you get quite a few in there. That's really awesome. So this was, I think, already on sale for like $5.49, and I got this for like $2. It was awesome. So that's why I got them, because I knew I had this guy here. And yeah, so this beautiful like frame here and that one. So this is really, really cool. And here is a Dollar Tree haul. I just got a little stencil brush. I got some pop dot adhesives. I got two of these. And then I went to another Dollar Tree, a third one near my friend's house. And they had different type of stickers called fancy stickers. And these are so beautiful. These little bottles here, uh, the, like the glass mugs, um, like Christmas, uh, you know, balls, but they don't have Christmas um, like sayings or anything, but just very beautiful. And wine glasses. And then I had already used this one and in a in my next video, actually the one that's right before this, perfume bottles. And I got this to celebrate Pride Month. I am a big uh, Pride supporter, so I wanted to do like a Pride, um, maybe a painting, or I, uh, do some, you know, uh, Pride themed cards. And so that is my quick little Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, their selection wasn't great in that Dollar Tree, quite frankly, but I did find at least different types of stickers. So that was cool. Whew, okay, <laughs> I had to take a breath. So this is Hobby Lobby. Now, I had bought this a few weeks ago because I got this like whole um, huge uh, lot from Gina, from Gina Loves to Craft. And inside was four different embossing uh, powders. So I was like, well, you know, I have this embossing powder uh, I don't know if I showed this to you guys already, but this is the heating tool I got. I believe I got this from Hobby Lobby. So this is really cool. I love that. And I believed I used my, whenever I get like a bigger thing, I use my 40% off um, coupon. So I don't remember how much is with either it was 20 or $25, but then it was 40% off. So I kind of saved that for like a bigger item. And I got this. This is really, really awesome. This is like a tag maker, a tag punch, and you can make three different sizes of these scalloped uh, tags. So this is really heavy. So this was originally uh, $20. I got it for $11.99 because I used this, uh, my 40% off coupon on this guy. And I also got some embossing pens. These were like $5.99 for two of them in there, the white and the black. And I figured, you know, uh, because I do not have, like, the big shot or, or a bigger um, uh, die cut machine or embossing machine, I could also use that. And I don't, you know, I could use my little stylus. So the combination of these three, these four things, I could, I could absolutely do. Use these big guys right here. And this I will show you in a minute because that is a project I made with some of these papers. So this is from Hobby Lobby as well. And these are, I only get them when they're like 50% off. So this was like $9, it was like $4.50. If they're $10, they were $5. So that's why I got them. And I just love these kits because they're just themed. I'm actually gonna make something for my friend Sonia, her last gift for her birthday. And I got, and I'm gonna show you, 
what I made already. And this is uh, Uncharted, the paper crafting kit. I thought that was really adorable. Um, and then the last but not least, I was so happy when I found this. I used a lot of it already. They had New York themed paper. This is so awesome. Look at this. So cool. I used most of it anyway because I'm going to show you what I made. All right. And I'm going to do the same thing for my friend Sonia. So I made, my husband just left the house. So I said, let me do this really quick. I made him this awesome book. So this was a composition book I bought literally for a dollar, a dollar and change. Okay, I'm going to make one for my friend Sonia with the Chasing Rainbows paper. Okay, so I had this idea because he loves to write and so does my friend Sonia. That's why I'm making her one and I made him a, um, a unique composition book. So I thought this was so cool. Statue of Liberty, a little bling here, this really cool tag, um, little New York pretzel. And I made him, it has a big pocket here, huge Statue of Liberty, some more stickers, a little bit of bling there. So I thought that was, you know, a train. And then the first page, I kind of just put some really nice sayings on your hope, anything as possible, live, and then the back, I did all the New York taxi paper with another pocket in the back here, with a little more bling, and yeah, I just add a little uh, bling to it, so that is that, and then here is the back. And has like a New York City map. Sorry about that. My mother came in again. Just told her I was recording. But anyway, it's okay. So yeah, I used the stickers like You Are Here to... And this is actually my favorite place in the world. Astor Place. That's downtown Manhattan. So he's going to love this. So I'm going to do the same thing for my friend Sonia. Using the Chasing Rainbows paper. She'll love this. We're both big kids, so I'm going to make her this. And yeah, so that is my haul. I do have something coming from Little Birdie. It's actually supposed to be coming today, but um, it was a lot of stuff here already. And I also got a small order from um, Tonic Studios, and that's taking forever. But I will show you that, you know, when that comes, I will show you guys that when that comes. All right, guys, so thank you so, so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed my huge, crazy haul. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I am truly enjoying doing these paper crafts just as much as I'm enjoying painting and um, my resin art. I am so happy I added this to my repertoire. This is so much fun. And it's actually, it's just therapeutic. All the art I do is really therapeutic. Um, I really encourage you guys to try, you know, just any type of art. If you're not artists who are watching this, I really do. You don't have to buy all this stuff, you know, just try something new and different. And it's just so relaxing and creative and therapeutic. You make gifts for everyone. It's just an amazing um Thing. It's a phenomenon to me that something like this could be so therapeutic and I am just enjoying this so much. So I hope you enjoyed it too. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to follow me on social media, my links are below. And guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.